welcome back to Life with Kendra. Kendra, as you can see, is a little bit shocked um, because she decided to take JJ um, up to the rec center, to the park, to let him play. And while she was here, she was just kind of watching JJ play and she noticed this guy standing over here and immediately she recognized him. This is Deshaun Clark. This is the baby boy that Kendra gave up 22 years ago. She is absolutely shocked to see him standing there. And so she is going to go over. And um, I think we're going to go over and just do the get to know. And maybe she's just going to um, introduce herself and say, you know, is your name Deshaun? And um, he's going to say, you know, yes. And they're going to kind of realize, who, you know, he's going to realize who she is. And, you know, um, she's learned that he's a perfectionist. But this is the first time that she has seen him um, in 22 years. Oh, I should mention that Kendra had a semi-open adoption. Um, so she got to send him letters and got to see pictures of him. So that's how she knew who he was. They're going to have some deep conversations and just kind of talk. And she's like, I've wanted to reach out to you for so long. I've thought about you every day, um, you know, since I gave you up. And he's like, here, come come in and sit. And she's like, Deshaun, I just want you to know that, you know, I I did what I thought was going to be best for you. And he's like, no, my, my adoptive parents were amazing the michaelsons raised me you know like their own and i i've i've had a good life um and so i want her to to ask a couple things about him i just want her to um to kind of get to know him a little bit ask him about um his career and we're gonna tell him um you know the the wedding story we're gonna talk about getting married and um she's like you know you have you have three siblings and um they're they're amazing and i would love for you to be able to uh you know get to meet them and you know that's that's your little brother over there that's that's javier jr um we we call him jj and he's like i have siblings like blood siblings um he's a support technician which is really cool um, Kendra is just absolutely over the moon. Um, she is so happy. Um, and she's feeling a deep connection. She's, um, she's just absolutely taken aback by getting to see him, um, in person. And so what I want to do is I want to have her... Um, just give him a hug because it is getting late and um, they are going to have to get ready to leave. Oh my gosh, you guys. This has been so long coming. I mean, I just, I can't. I absolutely cannot. I just want to see the look on Kendra. Stop. Look at how happy she is. Oh my gosh, I could literally cry right now. So maybe what she's done is she's just kind of um, called over um, JJ and she's um, she's just going to uh, kind of introduce them and she's going to say, JJ, this this is your big brother. Uh, this is this is Deshaun. He's like, hi, nice to meet you. He's like, hi. So I want to have JJ get to know him a little bit as well. So I think what she's going to do. And she's going to go ahead and give him another hug because, um, you know, it is getting late and we do need to get going. She's just going to hug him again and just, um, oh, JJ's getting tired. He's going to go ahead and start heading towards the car, I think. Uh, but Kendra's going to give him a hug and she's going to say, you know, it was so nice um, to get to see you again. And she's like, I've just loved having the chance to... Um, to talk to you and I just want you to know that I love you very much and he's like thank you it was really good to 
to finally get to see you too. So she's going to go ahead and head home. And she cannot wait to tell Javier uh, what happened because she is over the moon. So Kendra has just arrived home. And she is so excited to go get to tell Javier um, about actually getting to see um, Deshaun for the first time in a really long time. So Kendra's telling Javi, she's like, Javi, you will never guess who I saw at the park today. He's like, who? She's like, my son, Deshaun, my oldest son. He was at the park and I recognized him right away. And he's like, oh my gosh, honey, that's that's amazing. That's fantastic. And JJ is telling his dad all about it. He's like, I have a big brother and he's so cool. <laughs> And Javier is just listening very intently. And he's honestly, he's so happy that, you know, Kendra had the chance to sit and talk with her son because he knows how hard that decision was for Kendra um, to give him up. And he's like, honey, I'm so happy for you. And I'm so glad that you finally got the chance to see him. And she's like, well, actually... I want you to meet him too, of course. I want to invite him and Amari um, over for dinner. And I, I just, I think it would be great for us all to sit and have dinner together. And he's like, I think that's a fantastic idea, dear. Let's, let's absolutely do that, yes. Javier, him being so supportive of Kendra, you know, finally um, getting the chance to sort of nurture this relationship with her oldest son, he's... He's so happy for her. And I love that because, you know, for some guys it may be weird, you know, to have your wife with whom you have three beautiful children all of the sudden, you know, um, have a child that she had with someone else um, that, you know, she had given up for adoption, um, kind of come back into the picture that I'm, I'm sure that that may come with a lot of... Um, emotions but Javi has handled it so gracefully and with such class and I'm just I am completely flabbergasted at his support for his wife I think it's incredible all right Javi is home and we're gonna have him um maybe we'll just hire a repair service at this point because I don't think that Javi is really in the mood to have to take care of this stuff um he's exhausted he just got home from work and really all he wants to do is take a shower um he needs a break he is ready for a little bit of a vacation and he has seven vacation days um so i'm wondering if maybe he should take some time off work um, and just kind of spend some time working on maybe some of his skills um and just kind of relaxing a little bit so we're gonna have kendra cook a grand meal and i think we're gonna have her make a turkey dinner because we are going to be we're gonna be having our little dinner party it's supposed to start at eight o'clock um so javier is in here um you know just taking a little bit of a shower we need to have JJ come in and kind of start getting ready for this dinner party as well. So he's going to go ahead and come in and use the bathroom. It looks like Lachlan also needs to use the bathroom. So we're going to have him go potty. Look at Kendra. Doesn't she look fantastic? It looks like Deshaun has arrived. So I want Javier to go over and introduce himself to Deshaun. And Kendra, of course, is so excited to see everybody. Oh, I love that. I love that Javier just came over and gave her a big hug. All right, so Kendra has finished dinner. So we're gonna call um we're gonna call everybody to the meal. Look at everybody coming to grab some dinner. Oh, Deshaun sat next to Kendra. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, you guys. I'm going to have um, Javier kind of pause on eating for a minute and we're going to have him go ahead and put Lachlan uh, in the high chair. It looks like everybody enjoyed dinner and even little Lachlan 
is saying hi to Deshaun. I think Kendra has really enjoyed getting to um, kind of introduce everybody to Deshaun. Javi and Deshaun have decided that they are going to go out and throw the football outside. I know that it's 1130 at night, but honestly, I don't even care. Look at them. I love that Javier is putting in the effort to get to know Deshaun because he knows that it's important. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he knows that it's important to Kendra. Um, <laughs> I love that though. That's so cute. Kendra, get up. You cannot be sleeping, girl. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> okay, now that I think everybody is all done with dinner, we're going to go ahead and let Lachlan out. And she's just going to start, you know, cleaning up from dinner. Lachlan probably needs to go to bed. It looks like um, he actually needs a little bit of a bath. So let's uh, have Javi come and give him a bath. Look at how happy Kendra is, you guys. She's cleaning the house, but she is completely over the moon happy. I have not seen this girl smile like this <laughs> probably since her wedding day. I mean, this is huge, and she is so excited. I have no idea why she's, like, not cleaning up these dishes. She picks them up, and then she, like, goes and puts them right back down. So it looks like everybody is getting ready um, to head out and I think that's probably a good idea because it's like two in the morning um, and they're all pretty much exhausted so we're gonna have Javi go ahead and put Lachlan to bed and then he's gonna go to sleep himself JJ is on his way up to bed and then of course Kendra uh, will be off to sleep as well but I think this went really, really well. I'm really excited and I'm so happy um, that they all got the chance to meet Deshaun and talk with him and start to get to know him. And I'm really excited to see um, that relationship kind of grow uh, as things go on. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. It might be kind of a long one, so I apologize. But thank you guys so, so much for coming to hang out with me today. If you are new to the channel, please make sure that you do hit the subscribe button. Uh, once we hit to 300 subscribers, we're going to be doing a little giveaway. So I'm really excited for that. And then uh, leave a like on the video. It really helps me out. So thank you guys so much. And I will see you all next time. Have a fantastic rest of your week. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.